welcome to our review today. Uh, today we're doing uh, it's a mainstream one. Uh, you've seen the the, the uh, title and everything. Uh, it's Heinz uh, Tangy Jalapeno Hot and jalapeno. Zesty. Uh, splash on pizzas, pizzas, uh, pizzas, pastas, and salads. Um, saw this in the mainstream shop. Thought, hey, why not? Let's review it. Um, we put the, the ingredients up as normal. Um, it, it's got jalapeno, 13%. Uh, sugar, peppers, onion, garlic, the standard sort of things. But it'll be interesting to see what what it tastes like and everything like that. Um, today we're in Rosemore Garden, uh, RHS. Uh, first thing is, I've already broken the sealing mechanism. <laughs> okay. Oh dear. So, good shake. And let's see how it goes, boys. Okay. This is, right. this is a real English country garden, isn't it? Yeah. I'm loving the surroundings. So, oh lord, that's like... Um, it better be worth it, Heinz. That's so, almost syrupy, mate. Yeah, it's right. Yeah, man, I lie. Okay. So, that's yours. Alright, what's the thing? It's quite... It's quite syrupy gloopity, as you can see. Um, it's, it's actually got that um, sort of sweet, grassy, earthy smell you, you associate with jalapenos. Yeah. On the nose, which 13%, I, I, I thought we probably wouldn't get that, but it smells, it smells a little bit sweet, but um, yeah, you can, you can definitely detect the jalapeno smell there. Yeah. It's a, you know, it's a, it's a typical Heinz branded uh, label on there, um, you know, nothing different. Um, just looking forward to tasting it because, uh, you know, like, like we said, we don't really do make brands and uh, thought, hey, oh, it's a chilli sauce, it's dipped in chilli pepper, it's good. Absolutely. Gents, three, two, one down the edge. Oh. It's quite vinegary. No, very vinegary. Oh, yeah. Um, it's definitely got sugar in there, you've got the sweetness. Um, it's very sweet, it's very... Um, That's disgusting. Do you like that? That's just do, I, do, I, do I like? I wouldn't say I, I, I would be one that I'd go out and buy. I think. It's, yeah, it's very vinegary. You got the sugar. Oh, you've got the, so much vinegar in there. Yeah. I don't, I don't, that's too much vinegar. Mm. That's too much vinegar. And that's the first ingredient. Right. I can see it there. Spirit vinegar. Yeah. Man alive. So already, um, <coughs> you've got your preservative as your, as your main ingredient. Um, there, is, there is. Yeah. So you got, they put sugars in there to, to sweeten it. No, I wouldn't buy it. Definitely wouldn't buy it. No. Nick? No. I wouldn't buy a, a sauce. That's how I actually mm. you both yeah. said. The main of, of uh, vinegar in it just outweighs anything mm. else. And the, and the thing is, is, you know, we review so many sauces and, you know, very, very similar sauces. Um, sorry, I've got a slight burn in the back. I know. That vinegar um, just, just attacks the tongue. You know, we, we taste a lot of like artisan gourmet sauces and everything like that. And, you know, you pay for what you get. I can't remember how much we paid for the bottle, but um, you know, but you do pay for what you get. So there's no love in there. No, um, you know it's just it's thrown together, isn't it? Yeah. It's yeah. thrown together. It's you know if you if you want a cheap chili sauce, that's it. But it's not really a chili sauce. It's vinegar with with a very with slight. It doesn't even taste the jalapeno though. That's the thing. It's, it smells no. a bit on the nose, but I'm not getting any of that flavour. No, you get you get a taste of chili. I mean, it's a green, it's green jalapeno. They've obviously done with it because it, the sauce is green, so it wouldn't have been red because it'd be red. Um, so they're not. So you're going to get a bitterness it's, off that, aren't you? It's like having um, a liquidised pickled jalapenos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it is. But it's, it is, it's strength of like pickling vinegar. It, well, no, actually, pickling vinegar, it's got some spice and sweetness to it. Yeah, that's just aggressive. Yeah, I'm and actually finding that's like I feel like the roof of my mouth is burning. But it's oh. The thing is, it's like I, I don't know. I, I genuinely, I've never tried the Heinz products um, before. I wanted to do this with an open mind. Um, you know, if, it, if it's great, it's brilliant. You know, great as a, as a mainstream source, and it's kind of thing that might get people looking for more. But uh, that I think is a very poor representation of a hot sauce. And, uh, I, I, I wouldn't splash it on anything. No. No, but definitely not. Maybe so, uh, as a, an alternative to vinegar on chips or something. If I wanted to find a use for salt and vinegar and just buy vinegar. You know, so, you know, such a big corporation as well. Um, you know, big brand, sorry. Um, it's expensive. 
we were expecting more. We were expecting more. Really sorry, guys. Um, it's the end of our review, and uh, unfortunately, I'm giving it the. Um, That's a thumbs down. Thumbs down. Thumbs down. Sorry. Thumbs down. No, I'm sorry. Yeah, but well, I'm not sorry. I mean, if if you don't make a good sauce, you don't make a good sauce. And I can't, I can't apologise for, for not liking it. If it's just not very nice. So, no, hey ho. Anyway. I hope, hope you enjoyed the scene. Anyway. And the sun's come out. Hey. Cheers, guys.